Hello, Pastor Princess here. Thanks for joining me for another episode of Pastor Princess Cooks. Hi everyone. Hope you had a great week. Me? Can't really complain. Are you tired of Charlie Sheen yet? Me too. But you know, it's really not his fault. It's um, the media. The media's. What else? Who else? Charlie, I have a message for you. Smarten up. Do you know how lucky you are? No, really. You need to be grateful for having so much. Well, first off, you're a white male. Privileged. You're rich. You're good looking. Most importantly, you've got children. Do you know how lucky you are to have children? Not only that, you can afford to take care of them. So, my advice to you is get help. By the way, What's your friends and family doing? They should be dragging your butt into rehab or something to get you straight. Are you going to end up killing yourself? Because, you know, that would be a shame. And is that when people will actually say, Oh, Charlie, I feel so bad. We've missed you. No, no, no. They need to intervene now. And you, sir, need to get help. Honestly. You've got so much to live for. Be grateful. You are very, very fortunate. This hat, yes, it is my church hat. One of my church hats, anyway. And I am going to church later, and um, I'm going to pray that you will get the help you deserve, or the help that you really need, okay? So, the other day you said you've got tiger blood. Well, I have tiger shrimp for you. I'll show you. Come with me. But first, look at my beautiful flowers. I got them just for you. Yep. Look at them. Beautiful, bright, sunny. What more can a man ask for? They're not too girly, I hope. A nice masculine vase. Huh? Anyway, let's go see what's in the pot. Or let's see what's on the stove. But first, look what's in this big pot. It's soup. Yep. Lots and lots of soup. And it has... Mmm. Look at that, eh? It's got lots of noodles. Anyway, you're not here to look at soup. Let's show you what I've made specifically for you, Charlie. Yep, Charlie Sheen. First we have, guess what? Mmm? Mmm. Cheese filled spinach tortellini. That's right. And over here we've got broccoli and some lightly fried zucchini slices in, guess what? Extra virgin olive oil. And over here we've got Jumbo shrimp, tiger shrimp. Ah, oh, they smell so good. Mmm. Gosh, Charlie, if you could taste these, you change your wicked ways. Guarantee. All right, well, let's go get some stuff on the table just for you. Alrighty. So first, we will place some zucchini slices on the platter. Yep. Next. Some broccoli. Mm-hmm. And it's a steamed broccoli. Not too steamed, but you know, not soft, I should say. Nice and crunchy. Give you all your vitamins. And whatever else broccoli gives you. And I'm going to get the tortellinis. Like I said, these are cheese filled spinach tortellini. Okay. Ah. You want a raise, you say? Huh. You don't know how lucky you are, buddy, to have a job that pays you so well. While the rest of us must work for almost pennies in comparison, well, with you. But that's okay. We're trying to make the most of it, and we're trying to be grateful. So you should be as well. But that's okay. I'm hoping you will see the light and change your life. And 
be there alive and well for your children especially your children okay and here are the jumbo tiger shrimp that we have for you they're done in what else extra virgin olive oil and some seafood seasoning look at these babies oh and they smell divine and they're all yours well you're not gonna exactly get to eat them I will but you know they were created just for you because you said you've got tiger blood so I'm making you tiger shrimp and the zucchini slices and broccoli were done in again extra virgin olive oil the tortellinis they were boiled in well regular water for about 12 minutes pour the water off and this is what we have for you Charlie Sheen jumbo tiger shrimp oh I almost forgot this is probably not the best time to give this to you but well you know in a way you are a rock star so there there is your beer rock star hmm well like I said I probably shouldn't be showing you beer at a time like this but hey you're gonna get to it one way or another but seriously Charlie behave yourself and be grateful for what you've got okay everybody until next week this is the pastor princess saying ciao